as one of the oldest global youth organizations, the World Federation of Democratic Youth, WIFD, has been advancing the common ideals aimed at helping member countries to redress social imbalances in their societies. The WIFD delegation led by the organization's this president, Nicolas Papadimitru, and up. accompanied by SPYL's National Executive Committee members, informed President Gengob that development and the quest for equal rights are inevitable around the world. For us, the fact that we are welcome once more in Namibia, it's a recognition that this country, those people, share the common ideals, common concerns with the international youth. We have a unity when we speak about peace, when we speak about friendship, when we speak about international solidarity. Apart from preparing and lobbying for support for its annual festival, all member countries of the WIFD are also to meet for the General Council, scheduled to start tomorrow. That is the executive arm of the Federation. It will also take place in Namibia, and, uh, and we're also going to have the, the regional meeting, that means the Africans, we, we, the member organizations from Africa region, we're also having uh, a site meeting in order to, to prepare ourselves and formulate a common position on the, on the Pan-Africanism's agenda. According to Veiko Nekundi, President Gengob is receptive of the organization's activities, especially its stance on democratic principles and engaging the youth on crucial issues which are deemed beneficial for all citizens. The president is a revolutionary. We inherited from him and from many other heroes of this country the revolutionary spirit and the solidarity that they have championed throughout. So it was in the spirit of heroism and solidarity that he says, yes, that is a cause, that we have achieved our independence on the international solidarity. We must, as young persons, continue to provide our solidarity to all those that have been oppressed uh, by the imperialist forces uh, all over the world. Founded in 1945, during the struggle against imperialism, the World Federation of Democratic Youth has a membership of over 60 countries. Blanche Corises, NBC News.